Hello Year 2 and welcome to today's English lesson. Did you have a nice weekend? Brilliant. How did you get on with last lesson? Were you able to sequence the story of bubbles and maybe add some adverbs of time? If you did, excellent, well done. I've had some of your work in and I'm very impressed, I must say, with your sequencing from last lesson. And some of you even got some conjunctions in your sentences. So well done if you've remembered about that from last term, fantastic. Now today we're going to be looking at what an adverb of manner is. Now we've done adverbs of place and we've done adverbs of time before. So this lesson is going to be on adverbs of manner. Now we need to remember what an adverb is first and to help us we're first going to look at what an adjective So What is an adjective? Can you tell your screen what an adjective is? OK, brilliant. An adjective describes a noun. So, for example, we could have a beautiful butterfly flew into my house or we could have a slimy slug was on my kitchen floor. Those are all examples of adjectives, beautiful and slimy. Now, if an adjective describes a noun, what do you think an adverb does? There's a clue in the name. Pause the video and have a think. OK, shall we see if you are correct? Yes, an adverb tells you more about the verb. Oh, can any of you remember what a verb is? Shout some verbs out to your screen. What verbs can you remember? Wow, I can hear some brilliant verbs. We've got run, we've got shout, we've got laugh, we've got fly. Fantastic, well done. So an adverb tells us more about a verb. So look at the sentence below. She laughed loudly. So the verb is laughed, isn't it, in the past tense? And then loudly is how she laughed. It's the manner in which she laughed. She laughed loudly. And then secondly, she ran quickly. So that tells us how she ran. She ran very, very quickly. Right. Now here we have some adjectives and adverbs of manner. Now, let's have a look what we've got. We've got kindly, excited, safely, proudly, slowly, careful, angry, cautiously, helpful, angrily. You can try and read the rest. That would be brilliant. Now, what I'd like you to do is sort these into adjectives and adverbs of manner. So which describe a noun and which add to the verb? So tell us more about a verb and how it's done. OK, pause the video now and have a think. OK, should we see if you are correct? So the first one, kindly. Now, that's not an adjective, is it? The adjective would be kind, the kind woman. Kindly is how something's done. So you could smile kindly at someone and smile is a verb. So kindly would be the adverb that describes how you smile. So we've got kindly as an adverb of manner. Now the adverbs of manner are going to be in red, OK? Then we've got angry. Now, is angry an adjective or an adverb of manner? Yes, that's right. It's an adjective. So we're going to circle it in purple because we can say the angry man. What would the adverb be if angry is the adjective? If you talk, can't talk angry. Yes, that's right. You can talk angrily. Well done. Now, next one, cautiously. If you're walking, you could be walking cautiously. So that's describing how you're walking. So it is an adverb of manner. Well done if you got that right. Now, the next one, proudly. You could have got a certificate and you could have held it up proudly. So, yes. That's an adverb of manner. It tells you how you're holding your certificate up. Or you could smile proudly. OK, so smile is a verb and proudly is how the verb is happy. He is smiling proudly. He's very proud. So what would the adjective be if the adverb of manner is proudly? Yes, that's right. It'd be proud, isn't it? So the proud man smiled proudly. Now, what about helpful? Tell your screen. 
Yes, you're right. Helpful is an adjective. Describes a noun. So it could be the helpful boy or the helpful girl. What would the adverb of manner be from the adjective helpful? Yes, that's right. It'd be helpfully, wouldn't it? Well done. Now, well, now this is a bit of a tricky one. What did you think it was? Well, well is an adverb of manner. He played well. So played is the verb. And well is how he played. So he played well. He wrote well. He swam well. OK, so that is how he swam, how he ran, how he played. What about slowly? Ooh, what do you think? Yes, it's an adverb of manner, isn't it? It's how something was done. So you could walk, the verb, slowly. Or you could run, slowly. What would the adjective be if the adverb of manner is slowly? Yes, that's right. It'd be slow, wouldn't it? The slow snail. That is describing the snail, not how he's moving. If you were describing how he was moving, then it'd be slowly. Uh, angrily, what do you think? Yes, that's right. Adverb of manner again. So you could say something angrily, but then the person who's saying that might be angry, and that's the adjective. Now, healthy. What do you think? Yes, you're right. It's an adjective. It describes a noun. So it could be a healthy food. Now, if someone's eating not very well, they're eating bad food, bad bit food that's bad for you. How would they be eating? What would the adverb of manner be? Yes, it would be. Oh, if they were eating good food, sorry, not bad food. If they're eating good food. They'd be eating healthily, wouldn't they? So that would be the adverb of manner. Now, excited. The excited children. Yes, so that would be an adjective. It describes the children. Now, careful. Yes, that's another adjective, isn't it? What about adorable? The adorable kitten. That's another adjective. It describes the kitten, which is a noun. It doesn't describe a verb, does it? Now, what about safely? He drove safely. Well, yes, drive is a verb. And safely is how he was doing it. So it would be an adverb of manner. Well done. But happily. They lived happily. Well, live is the verb and happily is how they lived. So it's an adverb of manner again. And last one, kind. The kind man. Yes, that's describing the man, which is a noun. So it is an adjective. Fantastic. Well done. Now this time, you need to spot the adverbs in these sentences. But before we do that, should we spot the verbs so it will help us to find the adverbs? Because the adverb describes how the verb is done, so it must be near the verb, mustn't it? So, number one, what's the verb in this one? She spoke softly to her friend. That's right, it spoke, isn't it? It's in the past tense, the verb to speak. She spoke softly to her friend. Now, what about the second one? Let's find the verb in that as well. He listened carefully to his music. What do you think? Where's the verb? Tell the screen. Yes, you're right. It's listened, isn't it? He listened carefully to his music. Number three, he plays the flute beautifully. Tell the screen. Where's the verb in that sentence? Yes, that's right. It's, it's plays, isn't it? He plays. Play is the verb. Number four, she laughed nervously. Yes, that's right. It's laughed, isn't it? Which is the past tense of to laugh. And then number five, tell the screen, where's the verb in this one? She ran quickly down the stairs. Yes, it's ran, isn't it? Which is an irregular past tense of to run. Fantastic. Well done for remembering the verbs. Now, what I'd like you to do is pause the video and see now if you can spot the adverbs the adverbs of manner. Pause the video now and have a think. Okay, should we see if you were right? So the first one, she spoke softly to her friend. Where's the adverb? Yes, that's right, it's softly, isn't it? That's how she spoke, she spoke softly. 
Number two, he listened carefully to his music. Yes, that's right, it's carefully. That's how he listened to his music. What about the next one? He plays the flute beautifully. Now, this is one's a bit different because the adverb is beautifully. Now, this time it's not right after the verb, is it? It's at the end of the sentence. So he plays the flute beautifully. What about she laughed nervously? There's the adverb and manner in that one. Yes, that's right. It's nervously, isn't it? That's how she laughed. She was nervous when she was laughing, so she laughed nervously. And number five, she ran quickly down the stairs. Oh, what's the adverb of manner there? Yes, that's right. It, it's quickly. That's how she ran down the stairs. She ran quickly. She didn't run slowly. She ran quickly. Now, what I'd like you to do is on your worksheet, which is Year 2 English, 11th of January resource, there are some questions which are similar to this. It's question A, OK? And what you need to do is underline the verbs and circle the adverbs in each sentence. And then for one of them, it asks you to think of another adverb that you could use to change one of the sentences. So pause the video now and have a go. Okay. OK, how did you get on? Should we continue with our lesson? So the next thing we're going to do is match some adverbs with the verbs. So some adverbs of man with the verbs. Now, what verbs have we got? We've got whisper, run, watch, dance and eat. And we've got secretively. Oh, if you do something secretively, it's a secret, isn't it? You have to keep it quiet. Then we've got greedily. Oh, if you do something greedily, you want everything, don't you? And beautifully, you know what that means? Frantically, now we've done this one in class. Do you remember what frantically means? And carefully, you're very careful when you do it. So pause the video and have a think. Which verbs would go with which adverbs? Pause the video and have a go. Okay, should we see if you are right? So first of all, if you whisper, well, can you whisper secretively? Whisper greedily? Whisper beautifully, whisper frantically, or whisper carefully. What do you think? Which one would you match it up with? Yes, I think the same. I'd match it up with secretively. Well done. You whisper secretively, you really don't want anyone to hear, do you? So you're very, very quiet. Now the next one, run. Which one did you put match it with? Yes, I matched it with the same one. Run frantically. Remember, we did this in um, Little Red Riding Hood when the man had his arms above his head and he was running and he was running so quickly and he was really, really anxious and he wanted to get away from the wolf, didn't he? So that was frantically. Runs frantically. Now, watch. What about watch? Yes, that's right. right. If you watch carefully, pay a lot of attention to what you're watching. So that one can go with that one. What about dance? Can you dance greedily or dance beautifully? Which one do you think it is? Yes, that's right. You dance beautifully, don't you? And that is the way you, you dance beautifully. So the verb is dance and the adverb is beautifully. So it describes how someone dances. And finally, eat. Yes, you eat greedily. So if you eat greedily, you eat all the food. Hey, don't leave anyone for any for anyone else. That's what greedily means. Now, what I'd like you to do now is on the same worksheet as before, there is another question, question B. And you have some sentences and they have some gaps, okay? And you need to decide from the adverbs of manner that I've given you which one fits in which sentence, okay? Brilliant. Well done year two in your English lesson today. You've been fantastic. Tomorrow we're going to be doing some more about adverbs of manner. OK, so have a lovely rest of your day year two. Bye.